The goals of the CSF Computer Coding Workshops are to stimulate more student interest in science and engineering careers, especially computer science, and to help prepare students for university study in the STEM disciplines in general. Adjunct Program Manager of the Caribbean Science Foundation, Gillian Hassel, says the first of multiple workshops in St. Lucia will take place every Saturday from 9 a.m. to 12 noon between January 12th and March 30th, 2019 at the Castries Comprehensive Secondary School and will culminate in a public showcase by the participants on March 30th, 2019. It's quite a long commitment, it's 12 weeks, so we're requiring that the participants are committed to this um, initiative, but we expect that when we're finished with that, that they will be able to offer themselves up to industry, to either design websites or to create mobile apps that will be of benefit to the country. Professor Cardinal Ward, who is the Interim Executive Director of the Caribbean Science Foundation, says the CSF is excited to assist St. Lucia with the diversification of its economy by harnessing science and technology for economic development, thereby helping to raise its standard of living. The goal is to take these, the brightest in the Caribbean and help them to prepare to go to the university of their choice and we encourage them to stay in science and engineering because engineers create more jobs than doctors and lawyers, which is where most of our bright young people go. And we think that to build this economic pillar, to start building this new economic pillar for the region, we have to also encourage more technology companies to come into the region and also encourage our people to become entrepreneurs, some of them who, who are, have that in their veins. The CSF, which is headquartered at the Cable Campus of the University of the West Indies, Barbados, is undertaking the training with grant support from the U.S. Embassy to Barbados and the Eastern Caribbean and the Organization of Eastern Caribbean States, the OECS. Minister for Education, Innovation, Gender Relations and Sustainable Development, Honorable Dr. Gail Rigobert, has meantime thrown her support behind the initiative. So there's really marrying all the fancy stuff about robotics, science, e-skills, digital competencies, all with a view to exciting our students when it comes to technology and, and leveraging technology, not only for recreational purposes, but also to enhance their employability. And that is why I'm particularly happy with this initiative. St. Lucian residents who are interested in a career in ICT, particularly in website or mobile application development, are encouraged to apply to participate in the workshop. Applicants must be Caribbean citizens over the age of 15 years, out of school and at risk youth, individuals with disabilities, females and science and mathematics teachers are especially encouraged to apply by visiting the website caribbeanscience.org. From the Communications Unit of the Ministry of Education, Innovation, Gender Relations and Sustainable Development, I am Chris Satney reporting.